Alright, I'm gonna be good over here. Somebody make sure that we Okay. We're good. Phone calls. Yeah, yep, there we go. We got confirmation. Yeah, we go. I didn't turn off the speaker. Oh well. Hey, Shalom, Shalom. Uh, we are the brothers of the Great Millstone. We branch here in Chicago. And first and foremost, we want to give all praises, all honor and glory to Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Kadash. Double honors to the apostles. Double honors to the elder bishops. Salutations to all our fellow laborers. Those who will be judges, right, and to the scattered that are scattered around the four corners of the earth, you know, and um, among the heathen that look like those heathen, all right, and to the uh, the few aquaf that are listening and learning, all right. We're just gonna jump right into this thing, and um, title is the earth is out of course. Can we put up Miss Stevenson's face? I thought that was what's gonna be up on the screen. Man. It is, it's there, but and I not a, a not my big face. <laughs> I got you. Yeah, and, and call. Uh, no, put up call first. Put up the one with all of them. All right? The first husband. No, put up put up the picture with all of them, brother. Baba Kusha. Um, that, that's how it comes through. I, I just cycled that, the pictures. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. But um, what you're looking at uh, is a woman who has multiple husbands. And her husband for uh, of 26 years. All right? Uh, I think uh, almost a decade ago, she brought in this new husband. And um, I wonder, they probably pop at the same time. And she's looking for a third husband. All right. So I'm going to read the article. All right. I'm going to read this article. And, uh, and then we're just going to go into the scriptures, man. Because this is, this is utterly disgusting. This is your queen. All right, and, and and for them and the and these two men, that dude called could call with his long hair, that dude soft as hell, man. All right, yeah, yeah, because ain't, ain't no way in the world you you know, yeah. No real man in their righteous mind will be cool to let that woman have another husband. Yeah, so I'm I'm gonna right read the now. I'm gonna read the article. Set righteous. Um. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah this is that's some this dude is a, is a. Uh, he he's right. He the king of the simps. He give his his ass a crown. But it says uh, relationship, and this is from and and this came from a, a news break, and it says she's wild. Woman with two husbands says every woman needs more than one man, seeks a third. All right, Kenya Stevens is pushing the boundaries of traditional marriage by exploring <laughs> the possibilities of adding a third husband to her family, living in North Carolina with her. Two husbands, Carl and Tiger Stevens, they took her last name. Yeah, I mean, simple. Yeah. Um, believes the woman should enjoy the same freedom and have multiple partners as men. That's not biblical. Absolutely. All right. I've been married to my first husband, Carl, for 26 years. Uh, that would be the light skinned dude with the long hair. All right. The simple. All right. They and they, long, they yeah. both look kind of soft. All right. Yeah. It says, uh, I've, I've been married to my first husband, Carl, for 26 years, and my second hug, husband, Tiger, for nine years. She said, sharing insights in the unconventional yet harmonious dynamic, all right? Especially when you understand, you know, what we've talked about, how, you know, DNA sticks to a woman her, her whole lifetime. Right. Right. So we're not even counting the DNA of all the men that she was with, before, you before know, man. before, right. you know. And so if she married two men, that means that the whole, she was always dealing with multiple men. All right, just, just keep that in mind. Yeah. All right. Um, it says, uh, known for her appearance on TLC, seeking a brother husband. Somebody look that up. I'll send the video. So, so, somebody look it up and pull it up so we can pull it up, you know. But it says, uh, uh, seeking a brother husband. See, the, the, bro, these women in Babylon and this soft ass Edomite that gave them this, this, mm -hmm. this power, boy. But it says, Stephen's journey. Towards polyandry, all right, and I know y'all got that definition on deck, began when she developed feelings for another man 12 years into her marriage with Carl. So, so that means that she was dealing with uh, this other man, Tiger, before Carl even knew about it. Right. Mm -hmm. 
she because she developed so 12 years into that marriage she started having she, feelings because she started because she, she she started having feelings because this man was putting dna in her mouth and and where else and i imagine they both hitting at the same time so i'm pretty sure they you know she's got it all in her anus too so she's just getting you know Trying. dna from 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 multiple men all right okay um it says and, and 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 you know we hey look we just come raw here at, at Great Millstone. It is, it, it is what it is, man. Gotta grape them. All right, but it says um, <laughs> after candid discussions, Carl eventually accepted her desire for multiple relationships. All right, and, and seeing it as an expression of her independence. What the? Where's it? Where's this shit in the, in the, in, the, in in any? Even in marriage vows, they don't say shit about a wife being independent, All right? But anyway, uh, and that and the marriage vows is wicked as hell. But nevertheless, it says, um, as sh he shared as a man, I support her in doing that, and which is not manly at all. Tiger, her second husband, who has been part of the family for nearly a decade, expressed hesitation, admitting uh, uh, concerns about. Being outshined by her new husband, all right? Because because think about it, yo, my woman's with me, but she developing, so she having an affair with another man. She finally decides to tell me, and she wants to bring this man into our, our marital chambers. So, but anyway, let me finish it, brother. Mm -hmm. Here, hold that thought. Let's get all this shit out. It says because uh, it's short. It's almost over. It says, uh, yeah. So Tiger was worried about being outshined by her her, her new and younger husband. Right. It says. Despite the challenges, the family maintains open communication as as they navigate complexities. Because when you, I, I, I'm willing to bet that that Tiger and and uh and and, and Carl is having relations too. Yeah. All right, I'm just because this shit ain't. This is a weird shit. It said, despite the challenges, the family maintains open communications as they navigate the complexities of this polyamorous lifestyle. All right. Stephen, a self-described free spirit, actively dates and embraces new connections. So, when when a woman says, "Well, I'm, I used to date that guy, now I'm dating that guy," what she really just said is that I used to fuck him, but now I'm fucking him. That's when you when you're dating, that's what you're doing. This is the person you're now having sex with. Right. All right, that it is what it is. All right, yeah, yeah. We gonna grab that scripture too. That Isaiah, that was definitely one of mine concerning Carl and uh. And and uh, uh and, and Steve Tiger there, go, All right, Carl. right, <laughs> right. Get it, Tiger. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh. This is uh. Hey. How, however, she acknowledges that Polly, Polly Amori, being a challenge, especially in society that favors monogamy. All right. Uh, her family story has sparked widespread discussions of polyandry and women's rights. To, to freely love. So this is more on it does have a, a YouTube video on it too. What about what about at, men at the bottom rights? of it? So but in America and Babylon, the, a man has no rights because the thing is is that if they're both shooting semen in her and she became pregnant, who's the father? Are they not gonna just worry about it? Well it, it's it's gonna be some D bull shit, this both our bike. You know, some V born red shit. This it's our bike. You know, we just keep it at your house. Well, these niggas wicked as hell, cause you know, with my son when he was coming up, uh, it was an issue with the, you know, I had an issue with the, the new dude, and I was talking to his brother, and he was like, "Man, Israel got two daddies." I say, "Nigga, what? No, the fuck he don't. He got one father." You know, we was having a whole thing where it, it damn near got serious. But <coughs> this is how niggas think that oh, if uh, she get with another man that this new man is of, is is the child father. So if a nigga, these niggas doing this wicked ass shit, they would accept it as their own child. But see, a, 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 that, that a real man you know what I mean? would not try to get in the way of a man of a relationship. Man now he, because he'll be like, look, man, that's your dad. You know, a real man. Like you know, you, you, we gonna be respectful toward each other. We both in this situation, but that's your father, man. That's All what right. a real man would do. Yeah, he did so, so. I got a scripture. Oh, this is Sirach 33, and I'm going to start at 18. <laughs> Hear me, O ye great men of the people, and hearken with your ears, ye rulers of the congregation. Give not thy son and wife and thy brother 
and friend power over thee while thou livest, and give not thy goods to another, lest it repent thee, and thou entreat for the same again. First of all, he that uh, begins the wife begins possession. That's your goods. Somebody grab that. Okay. Uh, not only is that your goods, you gave a woman, your wife, power over thee to tell you what she going to do and dip and deal with other men. So all right. Position. And technically, that's an Israelite man. So that's position. technically your friend. You let him have power over thee. You gave your preeminence up. Let me, I got a couple more because to get the preeminence. Oh, yeah. She running the household. Yeah. yeah. She running the household. And these dudes do look zesty in these pictures. Well, they on, look. Bro, they yeah. Look zesty. So when she not around, that's, I think that's where I call except the tiger. Man. Mm -hmm. All right. Yo, yo, yo. Oh, it, well, oh, hey, I'm just keeping it real, man. This right. shit don't look right. Because because you know that come on, bro. That was, that's that we don't know what they do in their bedrooms, but I would I, I would not be surprised if she be doing threesomes. And if they yeah. do oh, it, they doing it. And, and if they do well, it, you, you, what you mean you won't be surprised? They fucking do it. I believe so. And, and I believe that when she not around, they do call the tigers doing two things. I want when she around. It's a lot. They might be doing it when she around. Right, right. It, it says, as long as thou and livest and hast presently, give not thyself see. over to any. Wow. For better it is that thy children should seek to thee than that thou should stand into their courtesy. And all thy works keep to thyself the preeminence. Leave not a stain in thine honor. You the man. All right? You don't supposed to let no woman, you don't bow yourself down to no goddamn woman. She bows herself down to you. Nah, if not, man. you leave that woman. Yeah, you should be willing to, to lose everything before you lose your manhood. Come on, man. All right? He's king. He's the simp of the year. You want that, uh, <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Bobby shout, brother. Let, let, me, let me read this uh, this Isaiah first about that's what it's called in, uh, in, in Tiger here. Hmm. All right, that took on this woman's name. All right, it says, uh, uh, the show of their continents do, doth witness against them. They declare their sin as Sodom. They hide it not. Woe unto the soul, for they have rewarded uh, evil unto themselves. So it's nothing but evil coming to both Call and Tiger, man. Huh. And on this picture, they do look a little zesty. Yeah. You know, look like there might be a, a list. Oh, you know, coming behind certain <laughs> words. Okay, okay. Well, okay. So, well read that that's definition. The read. This, is, this is Sirach 9 and uh, 1. Be not jealous over the wife of thy bosom. But the second part is what I'm really focusing on. And teach her not an oh, yeah, evil no, lesson no, no, no. against thyself. You go let her do this? And she done talked you into this? Oh, you, she talked she talk you Something new that was fucking wicked as fuck. Yeah, here she talking about third one. She been you know what? He, she she was messing around on him when she told him. Yeah, yep. and now she got this third guy. And around. this guy was so worried about losing her that he let her do yes. do this this act. And like I said, and then I believe that that uh, you know Stephen and, and Tiger is yep. more than like. Uh, right. They yeah they brother wives all right I mean uh, brother husbands uh, 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 I, I mean I'm gonna bring out that definition hold your car brother hold that car uh, keep that car uh polyon polyandry is a type of polygamy in which a woman marries or mates with more than one man at the same time the practice of a woman having more than one husband or male mate at the same time. The term comes from the Greek words poly, meaning many, and enter, meaning man. Polyandry. So she has many men. All right? <laughs> All right? So so there you go, man. I had a scripture to Bring it out, brother. Bob Kishar. This is um, Habakkuk chapter 1, verse 4. But I'll maybe jump up. Ber verse 4. It says, therefore the law is slack. And judgment don't never go forth. See, this shouldn't even be allowed by whoever is in power right now. The laws, all right, it sh they, this shouldn't even be able to happen that they're able to do this. Yeah, so you right. should feel some type of way that the powers that be, those who are in ruling in charge and, and making the policies and making laws. And it's supposedly Christian-based. Yes, oh, nation. exactly. Oh. Supposedly, right? They allow madness, all right, wickedness. This is abominable, all right, to happen. 
and you should feel some type of way about it. That's right. And if you don't, then you win. That's right. Right. And it says, no, it says it says how they both are abomination. Mm -hmm. Even if you don't get into this particular thing, mm -hmm. but if you just sit idly by and you're cool with it, don't say nothing about it, don't speak against it, yeah. that means you with it. You didn't cry out. You didn't cry out. Deuteronomy 22. This is Deuteronomy 22, 22. If a man be found laying with a woman married to a husband, in this scenario, this was. Carl was with um, the hoe. And then here come Tiger joining in with the hoe. <laughs> this says, if a man be married, found lying with a woman married to a husband, oh. then they shall both of them. That's why they both should Both of them, them die. Both really. the man that lay with the woman. And the woman, so shalt thou put away evil, evil. from Israel. So, is that the law? That's the law. Okay, well, let me go back to this Habakkuk mm -hmm. chapter 1, verse 4. Mm -hmm. See, because it says if you uh, 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 handle that, if something like that happens, mm -hmm. then this is supposed to be the consequence so that you can put evil away from you. Ah, that, right. that shall put thou, so shalt thou put evil away from you. So if you allow it to happen, then it's going to be much you, evil. You bring more evil. Yes. To All right. So going back to this Habakkuk chapter 1 verse 4, it says, therefore the law is slacked. Mm. You see that law right there? That the, the, law, the law that in the eyes of the creator is righteous. That's right. Right? Therefore the law is slacked. Righteousness in the eyes of the creator is slacked here on the earth. And judgment doth never go forth. All right, it says uh, how that um, uh, the Most High God, he weighs actions. He is the one to say what's good and what's bad, All right? It says by, by him, by the Most High God, is actions weighed. And we should be in the same mind as the creator, all right, and his judgment. But going back to this, Habakkuk 1 and 4, it says, therefore, the law is slack, all right? And if the law is slack, it's going to be a bunch of evil going on. It says, in judgment, don't never go forth. That means you can just do whatever it is that you want to do. It says, for the wicked don't compass about the righteous, therefore wrong judgment proceeded. Mm. And that's why you got the world how it is today. Well, let me uh, uh, jump up because this was the mindset or, or sentiment of the prophet Habakkuk. He said, verse 3, Habakkuk 1 and 3, why dost thou show me iniquity? And cause uh, and cause me to behold grievance, for spoiling and violence are before me, and there are that raise up strife and contention. You see, so we should feel some type of way about this. We should be angry about this. You see, Those we should, fighting words. Uh -huh, we should be <laughs> sighing and crying because you know what? Other vexed. women, other women are going to try and follow suit with this. Absolutely, That's it. you Best. best believe it. That's it. Uh, so that's what, not, uh, that's yeah. like that's like that's the, uh, the the Lord had that when the woman they said when the women hear of this then they'll know then they'll start to insubordinate their husbands because women are simple and and women want power. Well, they, they wish they were us yeah. yeah hey but but they here is it talked done. about righteous Lot how he was vexed day mm -hmm. to day with their unlawful deeds. Here it is in an unlawful deed. This affects you. I got something that really, and then we these brothers got precept, but this goes right with what you just said. This is Isaiah 29 and 15. It says, Woe unto them that seek deep to hide their counsel of uh, uh, from Yahweh, and their works are in the dark, and they say, Who seeth us and who knoweth us? So it goes back to what you mm -hmm. said, the lawmakers that allow this mm -hmm. to happen. The courthouse, the, the justice of peace, wherever they went, yeah. that, that, that made this, this union and allowed this thing to happen, man. They, exactly. that, that was, a, that was a, a really wicked thing to do. Oh, we may I say right? something real uh -huh. quick? Because the these people may say, well, why you care about what they doing and why about move about? Well, this is cancer. And what, what happens with cancer? It's spread. It's spread. spread. It's spread. I got that scripture, y'all get that. Yeah. So when, when cancer <laughs> spread, what happens? Everybody talk about F U C K cancer. All right. Well, here goes some cancer right here. You ain't mad about it. You ain't gonna say F U C K what's going on right here. And right. if it spreads, it's just gonna get worse and more evil and more it evil. Yeah, exactly. Hey, hey, right, hey, right. Hey. And it's gonna, let me finish this scripture, brother. Uh, verse sixteen. So lock you. Like, no, I just, rather like damn. <laughs> no, it like, says, you the other shit. Surely your turning of things <laughs> upside down shall be esteemed as the potter's clay. That's it. For shall the work say unto him that made it, he made it me not. Right. Or shall the thing that it framed say of him that framed it? Right. So have no understanding. Right. So here it is. We the work. 
And then the Most High is the work master. And he say what the nucleus is, what a family is, this what the world is, this, this is how, this how it should, should be. Should be. This, is this is the order. order. This is the order. This is the order. This is the Most High set the order. But here, because he's the work master. Right. We're the work. And should we say to the work master, I forget the hell what you, you know. That don't feel right. 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 Can you act most against the world? Damn, that's the nigga one. Hey, hey, hey. Since you say it like that, y'all, and these scriptures is the work order. That's it. Okay. Here it is. It's the work order. This is what you should do. This is what you shouldn't do. This is balance right here. So how is a father going to be proud of his son? Wow. Damn. You know how you have a bond? You got to You love your daughter. Mm-hmm. But it's something even more special what about with, with your son. Because he's you. So it's like, so it's like, what the, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah. The Lord it's said like, yeah. who, who, it's like, what the fuck? Wait, wait, well, which one of us is this nigga's daddy? Now, hey, now we gotta right, go to the DNA test. You gotta go to the, the DNA. It's mass fucking confusion yeah. because Bizarre. other women are gonna do this and are probably doing it. They did. And, oh, and, and the thing is, is that you fertile because you got, you know, two, three dudes busting nuts in you. Uh, All right. And well, so what the other men just like, because you know what? I, I remember seeing some white folks and the two white guys were like, well, we, we, it's, it's our it's our son or our daughter or whatever. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Which is really some simpanzee <laughs> well, really? uh, uh, behavior, man. Some straight simpanzee uh, 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 behavior, man. Them, them two brothers, the elders over there, was holding scriptures, and then you brothers. Just real quick, um, yeah, you know these the other niggas doing another form. They call it being a sad nigga. Mm -hmm. That's that's trending right now. Mm -hmm. Niggas want to be the sad nigga. Wow. So so to, I can send it home to our dude. Meanwhile, yeah. shit, these niggas themselves. Meanwhile. Yeah. They both busting nuts, and like you said, that's confusion, man. And the Lord is not the author of confusion. It says, man, a woman should become one. That right. shit is just is wickedness, man. Well, yeah, but well, that's that's what she's an any, you know. She has an any. She don't have an Audi, uh, and, right? <laughs> she's receiving. Yeah. Of, right? All right. <laughs> the quick point. It really it proves prophecy is true too. It says a woman shall compass a man. The bitches. This shit is accepted in the world. Yeah. A bitch having a sad nigga, they got a TV show about this. But let a man want to have two women. He's a dog. He's the worst. Right. They got slow walks and everything. Right. The women have taken the role of the man in society, but that's prophecy. And also, that's that's how you know at the end of this place, man, because Sodom exactly. is fully... Sodom is reaching... It, 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 it's no, it can't go on too much longer. Right, exactly. Yep. I want, well, go ahead, brother. I wanted to make this quick point because you said it, it'll be a shame like a father wouldn't be proud of his son being um like this shit right here. Right. But it was this dude, he was into cosplay, but he ended up getting three three bitches and they was all his oh, women. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. even though they was weird as hell on the cosplay shit, oh, yeah, the, they, they, his dad was like, Thumbs up to his son. Like you got you got three bitches. And they all was bad. All of them was bad. And they all, <laughs> and, they, and, and they all pay bills and help out. And they were he like, man, I don't I don't know. I don't know how you I don't, it, I don't you know how you did it. I don't but what, three, but what that, that man did was, was completely biblical. That's a different point. That's so different. It, yeah, it's a, it's a void point to even bring up. What he did was completely biblical and normal, man. Exactly. And, and matter of fact, to not have multiple women is not biblical, it's not normal. Right. And, and, and we, got, we live Preach. in a society. Preach. We live in a society that has uh, uh, that's pushed monogamy, and monogamy is not biblical. No, no other way. I don't, I don't even know if it's in, in the in the Talmud, you know, or if it's in the Torah, or, or no, what they call the book, the Quran. I don't even. I don't think it says it in their books either. All right, yeah. not that I've read that books that thoroughly, but right. but right. the point being is that this, you know, this, this only within Christianity, which is totally made up. All right, the rabbis really shit on Christianity, and I'm I'm gonna bring out some points on that in another lesson. But um, what what you just described with the young man with his you know with his three women, right? That's, that's righteous. That's that's, righteous. that's that's and it's biblical. Yes. All right. You you what you what you what people have in the West have to understand is that they they don't practice what they preach. Right. All right. They push monogamy, but they've never done it. They even pushed monogamy in Rome, but they were but they were having <laughs> five hundred people oh, orgies geez. with animals involved, little children, Bacchus, oh, yeah, yeah. you know, yeah. uh, 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 all kind of. Uh, 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 
the Dionysus, all this weird shit was going on, man. And so we was so and that's and so uh, this is just an extension of that. Mm -hmm. All right, and all those weird things have never mm -hmm. happened, man. Yet they give these women, you know, just rights over rights over rights over men. Yeah. All right, and they pay because I imagine if she got if they if she got pregnant and 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 decide to leave her husbands, she gonna get child support from both of them. Yeah. And I wouldn't yeah. have bet the courts would give give her yeah. exactly. Yeah, that's right. I got they, 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 yeah, they've been sitting on scriptures. We ain't got to them yet, brother. Hold your scripture. Just to back up what you just said about uh, how they push mon monogamy, but they've always been in these weird, weirdo relationships because the rulers, going back to you know what Yaki said, the rulers of these people accept it. This is uh, Ecclesiastes, Ecclesiasticus, or Sirach, chapter 10 and verse 2. It says, as the judge of the people is mm. himself, so are his officers. And what manner of man the ruler of the city is, right. such are all they that dwell therein. Well, everybody's wicked because the ruler is wicked. Right. Exactly. Right. The ruler allows this. Matter of fact, the ruler pushes this. Yes. You see? He promotes this. You see? Again, just like the elder Benji was saying, if it's the other way around, you say, oh, man, y'all, that's, you a dog, and this, y'all crazy, and they'll tell the women, other women will tell the other women that will have multiple, uh, I mean, that will have a, a, a man with multiple it. women. No, well, I'm just saying the other way. Oh, the, God, a God. woman will tell a woman that deal with a man who got a few wives. Oh, yeah. Bitch, you stupid. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But this right here is cool. They ain't got nothing to say. They love it. Yeah, they love it. They she push it. Because they right. hypocrites. Exactly. Oh, they want they want to be like her. You had right. something else? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, actually, brother read some of it. Sirach uh, 10 and 1. It says, a wise judge will instruct his people. Right. And the government of a prudent man is well ordered. Yep. You know, he saw, you know, there's nothing wise about his ass. He's all about wickedness. Yeah, yeah, but the wise one that's going that's going to well order, you know, his society that he rules over is going to rule over it with the instructions of, of the Most High God, the Creator. Which is that's why the Lord going to set us up, man. That's it. All right, and take this damn devil out of power, man. That's right. That's right. Verse two: As the judge of the people is itself, so are his officers. I was and what matter of man the ruler of the city is. Such are all they that dwell therein. Man. That's right, brother. That's so it. It. Go ahead and read verse 3, Bob. Yeah, yeah, that's what y'all kind. A unwise king destroyed his people. And look at the world today. That's destroyed. It. The people destroyed. Why? Because of the king. Because of who's ruling right now. The basis is, of men. The basis of men, which is Esau, Edom, the self-proclaimed white man. And the heads of them are the JOOSs, man. The international Khan. bankers that's ruling right now in wickedness. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. probably one of them that... that Perform the ceremony. Bang. Was the judge in the, right. in the place or the justice of the peace? Right. Well, you can't be legally married to two people. They just claiming that shit. Yeah. It's just, it's just, just with like a civil like, right, like a civil union. Yeah, well, they found they some way of doing it. it. Exactly. They got paperwork and taxes, so it's they, against they, the it's against the law. They can't do it. America does everything that's against the law all day long. <laughs> but right. What yeah. uh, only one of them. If they file taxes, only one of those men is able to. It's only join. understood. It's only yeah. yeah. They only accept one. It's a, a whole thing about it. Interesting. But yeah, the, so, but no, no, no. But it's something even crazier than that nigga. The one that's not even legally married to the bitch went and still changed his last name. Yeah. So he paid and filed paperwork to get his last name changed. Damn. That that's madness. That's that's a mental they, retardation, man. They symbolize. Hey, yeah. and, and what's so uh, funny about that? Like you're saying, this bitch is not going to stop. She'll want a third or fourth. So that's just show you how weak these niggas are. Yeah. She's not going to stop. Exactly. And so you, she doesn't even respect you, dumb niggas. Dang. She's going for more and more because you niggas are not real men. Women respect real men. You niggas are not men. She's right. not going to stop. Before you know it, it's going to be 30 niggas in the house because that's <laughs> right. where her mind is at. And you weak-ass niggas are going to fall for it. What did the one, the, the, the younger husband say? He was worried about the new man coming in, the younger man coming in. And, and this will happen. As they get older, right. 
way to go keep recruiting a younger man. Swapping them out. Oh, okay. Okay. like cars. Right. No, she's gonna hit well, the wall. She hit that wall. She hit the wall and they they ain't happening. She ain't that far from it now. Yeah. Right. Right. She's right. Not, she know she, she she got a few moments left. But go ahead, right. Mr. Nah, it says uh, <laughs> two years. Sirach ten and three. Uh, wise queen destroyed his people, but through the prudence of them which are in authority, the city shall be inhabited. That's right, brother. The power of the earth is in the hand of the Lord, mm. and in due time he will set over it one that's profitable. That's it. That's, that's it. it. Uh, that's right. it. Which is the Israelites. Starting with the elect. That's Lord, it. We don't man, man. That's it. And Lord that's gonna give this damn devil the boot, man. That's He's it. a wicked piece of shit. He's allowing all this wicked shit to go on, man. Right. 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 And this is part of the height of Sodom sin right here. This is sodomy. All right. Sodomy isn't just homosexuality, which homosexuality is sodomy, but this is Jude 1 Strange. and 7. Even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them in like manner, giving themselves over to fornication. Mm. So this is this falls to that fornication, that adultery. Yeah. Because Sodom means burning. This is a, a, a burning lustful. bitch. This bitch is lustful as yes. fuck. Come. And these two dudes are allowing it. Yes, right, instead of correcting them, mm -hmm. giving themselves over to fornication Black. and going after strange flesh. Yeah. So homosexuality, yeah. bestiality, yes. this is all part of sodomy, man. Yes. All right. And yeah. going after strange flesh are set forth for an example, suffering the vengeance of the same fire. So this is a vexation, but it's perfect that it's mm -hmm. happening because soon enough. Fire is going to burn this place, man. Mm -hmm. right. This shit is wickedness right here. Yeah, it is wickedness. And it is gay because man, it one becomes one. Yeah. He basically sleeping with this dude. Come. His sperm is in there. She extra horny. She want another round. He tight. Well, go to him. She still got his nut in her. He going out eating a box. Yeah. 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 Nasty, man. That's, That's what the rap song. Yeah, they be right. Now imagine, yeah. you know, uh, they probably often sleep all together in the same bed. Right. She blowing both rods, taking turns, <laughs> kissing the one after blowing the other. Oh, that's crazy. Uh, yeah, and, and you know what? It's graphic, but that's just to show how wicked it is, how disgusting it is. A feature, in fact, I'm a graphic. This is a feature. Yeah, man, this, this, it is a shame, man. It, it's horrible to speak on. It's horrible to hear. But goddamn, man, it's Ephesians five and um and eleven. Uh, Ephesians five and nine. For the fruit of the Spirit is all goodness and righteousness and truth. Proving what is acceptable unto the Lord. And this is unacceptable. Right. Very unacceptable. All right? <laughs> unacceptable. Highly. Yes. Con. Yeah. Highly sin. Sodom. And have, no uh, uh, and have no fellowship with unfruit works of darkness, but rather reprove them. For it is a shame even to speak of those things which are done of them in secret. Right. It's a shame to speak on it. But all things that are reproved are made manifest by the light. Whatsoever does make manifest is light. Right. So it's part of being that light. We shine that light on it. Right. This yeah. is wickedness here, man. Yeah. All the possibilities uh for one is just wicked, just the fact it's happened, but all the other uh confusion and just just disgusting when you just think about it. Right. They swapping fluids together. Yes. That shit nasty. nasty. Yeah. Kiss blowing the one and kissing the and it ain't they with this shit, man. It don't gender life. It's right. calm. Hey, this, this. And that's and then Perfect. The second comment I seen on the picture, it said pH all off. Yeah. That's another thing. Damn. You bitches, that's why STIs, STDs, that's where that fish smell. That's where that smell, fish smell comes from. Because you have a natural flora. Boy, and your flora adjusts to that one man you're supposed to be with. Because mm -hmm. his DNA, your DNA changes to match his. So your flora or your natural bacteria, as people will call it, yeah. it uh it adapts. All right. Even when a man nuts in you, here's another thing, when a man nuts in you. Your um immune system down there shuts down, which allows for the sperm to even impregnate you. So you have multiple men nothing in you, your immune system is shutting down for each one of those yeah. and allowing for these different things to, to affect you. Yeah, right. And that's why your people are you, you get that's it. why you have these different it's like brother. No, no, I'm just thinking out loud, it's like it, brother. That's why it has different diseases, man. It's funny because I think about you know the last demon I was with that stepped out on me. Um, mm -hmm. the 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 fish smell, the pH was off. Yeah, that's that's and I knew that's through the, the spirit. I, the fa yes. yeah, because it wasn't like that. It was crazy. Yeah. It wasn't like that. And all of a sudden, it was like that, and, and so the spirit told me before before it even happened. I already knew, and then I got the confirmation. Mm -hmm. And what's crazy is through the spirit. Sometimes they can't smell it. We smell it. 
Because the nigga woman, the nigga woman, my baby mama did it to me. She couldn't smell a smell. Oh, she was a denial. And I brother. say, and I say, bitch, you <laughs> stank. Hey, bitch, you, <laughs> right. you know. You know, I got something though, real quick. Cause a bitch would be quick. Now I don't smell it. You know. Right. <laughs> I see. Hey, look, I see that. You ain't, you, that shit has been like on. I seen that somewhere on something. The bitches all smell it. Right. All weird. Right. 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 Meanwhile, Budissi is strong than a mother. Right. Right. The right. one child was like, what's that smell? Oh, that's what it was. Yeah. The the bitch, that's what it was. The when she was shorty on, called out. When she was braiding her hair or something. Oh, no, no, no. no. She was she was she was yeah. yeah, the shorty said, what's that smell? Like, she's like, it smells like fish. Yeah. She's like, no, it don't. <laughs> she said, oh, don't. It must be something out there. She cut the camera off of there. That's what it was. Damn. Child exposed her fish. Right. This Isaiah, this Isaiah 5 and 20. Warn to them that call evil good and good evil, that put darkness for light and light for darkness, that put bitter, because this shit is bitter than a motherfucker. You know what I mean? For sweet and sweet for bitter. Because here you is, you got you got a woman that sent for, <laughs> for one, I can guarantee that them niggas fucking each other. Yeah. They are. No, because because when Nick even even like with the even like <laughs> even like with the the uh the the man with the three women, they don't deal with a man having more than one woman. This the world we talking about. They don't right. deal with it on the righteous sense. They all having a fucking a uh, fuck fest. Yeah. The women the women are fucking the women. Yep. I when the man ain't home, they fucking each other. Yep. They maybe, not they maybe. make maybe. right kind. You can't say you guarantee it because that was the Good. one dude and the women they said we do not touch each other. They yeah. they made it clear. They said we do not deal with each other. Yeah, yeah, and not and not you know and 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 that's probably <laughs> some, but yeah. But these two dudes are gay. These yeah. two they dudes, fuck. right? right. And that's why I but, 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 but I hear what you're saying, <laughs> right? Because I'm I'm willing to bet the majority of people that are in those situations, that's huh. what's happening. It's a, it's oh, a whole man. it's a whole fluid thing. Because yeah, cause, because you got a lot of people that. That you know that 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 acknowledge that that's biblical and they're doing it from a biblical standpoint, yeah. but but I imagine that a lot of people who are in those salaki in those arrangements, they're not following that portion. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. it's just a you know. I mean, I mean, I he, he's sitting back drinking on a bed, you know, on the, in the chair watching his wives go at it before he go join them and shit. No, well, I'm sure that sort of wicked shit goes yeah, on. You got all the yeah, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, you gonna have that. You gonna have that wicked shit going on. Yeah, too. with the cosplay, he did. They did. The uh, chase did say they do be touching on each other. Right. That's yeah. all, so that's yeah. all. I mean, you have hey, they all they the have, different right. cases. Right. Talking, yeah. This yeah, is so. this is Jeremiah the fifth chapter. And, uh, <laughs> let's see. Uh, well, chapter twenty three. But this people <laughs> have a revolting and rebellious heart. They are revolted and gone. Oh. Neither they say in their heart, "Let us now fear the Lord our power." That giveth rain both the former and the latter in his season, he reserveth unto us the appointed weeks of the harvest. Your iniquities have turned away these uh, these things, and your sins have withholden good things from you. For among my people, I found wicked men. They lay wait, and he and he as he that set his snares, they set a trap. They catch men, as a cage is full of birds, so are their houses full of deceit. Therefore, they have become uh, great and waxen rich. They are waxen fat. They shine, yea, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. Damn. They judge not the cause, the cause of the fatherless, yet they prosper. And the right of the needy do they not judge. They say, yet they prosper. Yet they prosper. Hey, well, the only way to prosper is just like in Luke chapter 4, when Satan tempted our Lord and Savior, Yahweh how he said that, hey, all this glory and all this power and oh. prosper, I will give to you if you worship me. Right. So the thing is, they all these people, they worship Satan, yeah. whether you know it yeah. or not. All right. Yeah. I did the lesson. He uh, do, worship. Exactly. Right. Uh, I, I did the lesson. Do you tacitly uh, uh, worship Satan? All right, because some people don't know that they're doing it, but they're doing it. If you're not worshiping Yahweh Shai and about his righteousness, tacitly you worship Satan. Tacitly, uh, look it up. I don't know how to spell it. Yeah, T A C I T, tacit. Yes, L Y. In the in the in the uh, in the lesson, I did bring out the definition. No, I'm just curious because I have a little yeah. bit. Uh, tacitly, oh, I got a scripture. Ta well, let me read this definition. Ooh, okay. It says tacitly. This is the definition of tacitly. Uh, without saying so, or silently, or uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, tacitly. 
Mm. Uh, yeah. God. Right. So it says, in a way that is understood or implied without being directly stated. Ah, yeah, you see, so it. it's implied by your actions. It's implied by your mindset. It's implied by you being about this world and the ways mm -hmm. of this world that you tacitly worship Satan. You ah, see, because yeah. because again, if you're not worshiping Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah in spirit and in truth, you tacitly worship Satan. That's Colossians three. It's, it's the list of things that it says which is idolatry. Exactly. You, you're not saying you serve this idol. Right. No, it's just idolatry. Exactly. Yeah, kind. And so you should you, uh, uh, feel some type of way about what's going on. All right? But if you just idly and it's cool, you sitting by, then you're not like righteous lot. Right? Yeah, read, it says, uh, read this real quick. Uh, uh, love the good, hate the evil. That's it. Oh, real. So like, can I, you yeah, got yeah, me yeah. real quick. This Proverbs, damn, you, that's, damn, that's heavy, y'all. Proverbs 8 and uh, 13. The fear of the Lord is to hate evil. Mm. So if you fear the Lord, you have to hate evil. Right. Uh. You have to hate pride. Yeah. You have to hate arrogancy. Yes. And you have to hate the evil way. Have to. And the froward mouth do I hate. Mm. All right. So if you fear mm. the Holocaust from Yahshua, you serve the Lord. You can't be God fearing. You can't be a God believer. You have to hate evil, pride, arrogance, the evil way, and the froward mouth, man. That's it. I had yeah. some. I had some back bend you up. This uh, Sirach, fifteen and thirteen. The Lord hates all abomination, right. mm. and they that fear the Most High love it not. So oh, yeah, that's that's fear the Lord. You're gonna have the same mindset as the Lord. That's Everything it. he hates, you're gonna hate it too. Man. Bohemianly. That's yeah. it. Let, let me get this here in uh, this Second Peter. Uh, chapter 2, and I'm going to start at verse 5. This is in the NLT. It says, And God did not spare the ancient world, except uh, uh, for Noah and the seven others in his family. Noah warned the world of uh, warned the world of God's righteous judgment. So God protected Noah when he destroyed the world of the ungodly uh, people with uh, of the ungodly people with a vast flood. Later, God condemned the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah and turned them into heaps of, uh, of ashes. He made them an example. So Sodom and Gomorrah, what happened there was an example of what will happen to ungodly people. But God also rescued Lot out of Sodom because he was a righteous man who was sick of the shameful uh, uh, immorality of the wicked people around him. Yes, Lot was a righteous man who was tormented in his soul by the wicked wickedness he saw and heard day after day. This is what we're seeing and hearing, all right? This madness right here. And so it's vexing us. If you're not vexed, all right, then you're unrighteous, all right? If you're vexed and you're not about this, then you're righteous and you have hope of salvation and this story is all over the internet and all over the youtube and i'm willing to bet that the only people that are going to come against his wickedness are the men of the great millstone yeah. and the brothers that teach the likes likewise doctrine huh. oh, vocab okay all right oh, vocab don't say nothing about it you know that's it and uh i doubt if the other kept the 501c3 hey, charter camps they're not oh, gonna say they nothing can't about it. Right. because especially and she's being a black woman so because you know they they love and not right, and so exactly. So they don't want to mess up the money that comes in uh, they, for them teaching out them. for that super check. Right. Yeah. Uh, right. Tell right, both, right. Tell both your check. husbands we said hi. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. For <laughs> damn. <The> last verse. <laughs> <laughs> Second Peter two and nine. It says, "So you see, the Lord knows how to rescue godly people from their trials." Even while keeping the wicked under punishment until the day of the final judgment. Man, Phil, they they hard on that verse. Yeah, yeah, Phil to follow the hand of the power. Of these, <laughs> these simp cities, niggas, and niggerettas. When, 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 when the Most High put that hammer down, they all three going to eat and kill themselves. Mm -hmm. you know Damn. Damn. And then we huh? Then have one last yeah, freak and, 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 and then and then and, and then the last. Uh, I'm gonna go there. I'm, I'm gonna go there. Hey, <laughs> can I back up real quick, y'all? Yes, sir. This is Ezekiel <laughs> nine four, a classic. And the Lord said to him, "Go through the midst of the city." This is part of it being vexed right here. And the Lord said to him, "Go through the midst of the city, the midst of Jerusalem, which is the people before us a place to go to through the Israelites, right. and set a mark 
uh, uh, exemption from judgment. That word mark, the wa, means exemption from judgment. And set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that sigh and, and that cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. So we, you got to be against this shit. Come on. You can't, you can't just sit idly by and accept it. As long as they stay over there away from me, I don't care. No, you have to actively be against it. Yahweh Shai said, if you're, not, uh, uh, if, you're not, if you're not with me, you are against me. Well, because what you're doing by not taking a stance. You're enabling it. You're not, exactly. Complicit. And you're not letting your yay be yay or your nay be nay. Oh, God. You're God. really, you, and the Lord don't like that loop, lukewarm in the middle shit. God. All right? Yeah. He, he said, choose this day. Yeah. All right? So you're either going to stand on the side of the Lord. Right. All right? You yeah. remember what, 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 uh, uh. What uh, uh uh the Eve the mighty Ephraimite uh uh, uh um, what's his name the judge um, Joshua yeah you know what he said you know how his he and his family choose to serve the Lord man huh. all right yeah, yeah. Like, like, yeah then you got you got talking about loans this don't affect me all this it does affect you man what yeah. are you talking about and it's man? gonna affect your family your yeah. children this is why your daughters are sluts right now man yeah. this is why your sons are sodomites right now yeah, that's right. wickedness uh, begets more that's wickedness right. man you know what I, I, th I thought about would be the most hurtful thing all right because I have a daughter my daughter's my daughter's extremely attractive all right and I couldn't imagine you know to to click on a video Oh, and, and see, you know, so I imagine, and then, and it, and it, right, and it kind of, you know, I think about, it, I'm like, damn, man, these are people's. This is somebody's daughter, man. Right. Some, some man used to hold this this little girl and feed her and take care of her, and, man. and now she's just getting clapped, you know, and right. all right. Right. for the whole world to see, you know. So he either he is ashamed of that and has disowned her, or he just a proud ass demon ass simple, yeah. like Look at my baby. My baby's in the industry. A lot of these niggas so wicked. You know, you know? Uh, Pinky's uh, Pinky's father. Yeah, and it came it. out how he yep. was in jail. He done washed her film when he was locked up. Yeah, right. These niggas are wicked, Zaquan. Wow. Yeah. yeah. These yeah. niggas yeah, are yeah, wicked, yeah. elder. These niggas happy. These niggas be happy that they they they. they, they my daughter done made it. Yep. These he niggas boy, wicked. He, he, he didn't even trip. This, this is my trip. daughter. He in the, in the jail. So this is my daughter. Look at she going crazy. Yeah, yeah that's what he said. She going, she going crazy. Yep. She, she doing lesbian <laughs> scenes and every damn thing. Yep. yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 She, she, she doing strap on. Then she was taking dick too. She bitch is wicked. Yeah. She going crazy. Look, hey, folks. She going crazy. That's what he. That's what she said. That proud. He ain't trip. She like my dad didn't trip. He said, "Continue doing what I'm doing." She going. Crazy. He's so Come basically, on, he this got his, she got a blessing from her father. She got a blessing from her father. It's okay, baby. You go do your thing, baby. Yeah. You do your thing. You wicked ass. Right, she put money on his books. He cool with it. <laughs> right. Uh, this is the bag of what you were saying that, that you you wouldn't have bet that the only man that the only people out here is gonna be speaking out against. Well, that. I imagine the average man is very heartbroken, man. Right. And disgusted. Yeah. You know, don't want to talk about it. He's ashamed. Um, cause I know that, that Mia Khalifa's chick, her family disowned her. Right. Right. You know, her, matter of fact, she got death threats. She can't even yeah. go back to her she home can't country. Go back. Yeah. Can't go back and, uh, you go back there, they could, yeah, she going to get put in a hole and get stoned immediately. You talking about the A-Red bitch? Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. Right. But no, what you were saying, what you said about how this wickedness is, and you willing to bet that, like I said, we'd be the only people to speak out against it. She doomed to die in Babylon. And we would be the only people to speak out against it. Scripture says that too, uh. Uh, this is uh, Psalm 37, I'm starting five. Commit thy way unto Yahweh. Trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. And he shall bring forth thy righteousness as the light. So we don't want to shine the light on his wickedness in the process of. Okay? And thy, and thy judgment as the noon day. Rest in Yahweh and wait patiently for him. Fret not thyself because of him who prospereth. In his way, because of the man who bringeth wicked devices to pass. Wow, and that's and that's a wicked device and a wicked thing because I'm looking at this image, and usually when a husband and his wife, and and you know the the pictures of them, then you begin to see all the little ones, 
So what happens when the babies start showing up? Daddy, yeah. daddy. You know? <laughs> right. right. She don't want to have no kids because they've been together for over 10, 15 years and they ain't got no children. Because, ever. so that also means she's very selfish. Yes. Right. She's swallowing all the kids or taking them up, you know, no, no. the place where she can't get pregnant. So when a new baby comes, you know, she's going to be calling in school. He's like, who was that? Oh, that's my daddy. And who's that other guy? <laughs> that's, that's my right. other daddy. My two dads. Jeremiah 48. Well, three. three. Because oh, so yeah, she's yeah, she's already screwing the third dude. Right, right, right. Want to bring him into the loop yeah, now? Right. But you know what? Be so cold. The third dude, yeah, how I might put the spirit of vengeance on it and get all three of them. Man. I was just thinking that. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, I had a quick one. This is all um, Romans ten. I'm starting at two because, like the point y'all was saying, these people form that they think they got a mind of the most high. Like, oh, but God loves me. But um, this is what it's gonna say. This is Romans all um, ten and two. For well, our bear don't record that they have a zeal of God, but not according to knowledge, for they being ignorant of God's righteousness and going about to establish their own righteousness. Especially if the, since the Lord don't judge them right away. Come. They really think the Lord does. Come. Mm -hmm. Establish their own righteousness, have not submitted themselves into the righteousness of the most high power of God. So these people establishing their own shit. They say, hey man. We're going to do our own thing. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be this bitch. I'm going to have two husbands, and that's what it is. Maybe three, maybe four. The niggas going to be accepting into it because they goofies. You know, know. And goofy, you know. goofy ass niggas. And, 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 and they fathers taught And they fathers taught them. Yeah, and, and I wonder if she even works anymore at this point. Hey, let's be real. She probably got 10, man. You know? Oh, yeah. I, yeah, I mean, they, I'm, I'm wondering if she's if she to the point now the where she just bills, she just stays at home and basically she just cook, clean and get banged, you know, and then and, and then go out, you know, and have a, a mama's night out and whatever. And pick up the third. Dude. Pick up the third dude. She got a 19 year old. I got a precept. Yeah, this is a uh, First Corinthians chapter six, verse uh, sixteen. What know ye not that he which is joined to an harlot is one body? Dang. For two said he shall be one flesh. Like the brother was saying, like that, that that's that's off, man. You got all these interchanging of fluids, and it's no it's no uh actual head in the house, all right? They're just simpanzees. They're, they're, they're what the world would say what a man is supposed to do to just protect and, and provide for this woman. He's supposed to she love can do the fuck she wants. Well, that's why she can't pair bond, beloved. Yeah. She can't pair bond with the man because she's that's why she's trying to find fill that void, and she's going after the third one now. Yep. Because wow. she can't pair bond with the ones that she with, and, and she living, don't. Right? She don't respect them. She, she don't, don't love them. She, no, you <laughs> physically. They they proved it, man. I mean, even Esau actually used some real science for a change. Right. The DNA of a woman stays. I mean, the DNA of a man stays in a woman in a lifetime. Right. Yeah. All right. So when you got all these different sperms in you, you can't you can't pair bond that that pheromones and that that biological connection. You totally. can't have with one man. Right. You got too many. She can never have it. And that's uh, why she comes up with schizophrenic because right? of the fact that she's trying to she's trying to pull everything that was decent about every dude and make it be on one guy. Right. Well, she, she no can't. She, it won't happen. It won't. It can't happen because she got too many DNAs in her. And, with, and, and I'm thinking about all the men she was with before these two. Absolutely. And now she's constantly getting you know uh, semen from these two, and now this third guy. She can't pair bond with any of them. Oh, no. That's why she was having it. So she was stepping out on look. You got to read in between the lines. She was too. stepping out on call the whole time. Right. Yep. Yep. All right. Yep. Carl she was stepping out on leader. call the whole time. Call is weak. He didn't want to lose her, so he just let her. Know. You know. You know? Right. Uh, what's that song? Don't don't just don't. I don't want to know, no. bitch, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> right? That's right. that's, that's yeah. Paul. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Call call is that I don't want to know, dude. Yeah. Keep it on low. All right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You know he he's like baby. That's right, jealous. that is a weak ass. Yeah, that, that's that's, that's, that's Carl, song. man. Yeah. So, I, I first heard that song, man. I got so, mad, man. What about the I, de I deserve <laughs> for you to go? I would have. Yeah, that weak ass nigga. Right. Weak. That right. shit is weak too. Yeah. I, I deserve to be cheated. Nigga say I, 90s R&B was good, but 90s R&B was, was, was good. It was, it was, it was, it was the level, the simp, the sympathy. 
was superb in the nineties, boy. It was that big and ass. I agree. That big and ass crying ass, begging ass era. I get it. But that was just as bad as you know Esau pushing Jake to put that gangster rap out there. Yep. You know what I'm saying? They also put that you know shit for feminism out there and. That they threw it all out there. They threw it all out there. They put like the feminist shit back in the 80s and the 70s, like Prince. Great artist. I'm not saying he ain't. Prince he was very effeminate. Yeah. Yeah. He pushed that. That's he why was. Michael Jackson's talking voice wasn't his regular yeah, voice. Yeah, you heard him talk. you right. like, damn. Right. right. That's right. So yeah. he on stage, he still right. used that soft voice and all this shit. Because yeah. yeah. they right. make you do that, man. That's and it wasn't his voice. I got a script. He said he would be he did. Yeah, yeah, he did. Yeah. 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 What that that, that Mike put the flops on Pac? Yeah, yeah. 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 He said he beat his ass. He Mike ran them glitter, them glitter socks. Well, he is from Gary. He has from Gary. Tupac from the birds. And, 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 and not only and Tupac birds, wrote Dear Mama. Tupac was prettier than a lot of them motherfuckers. God. Oh yeah. This Romans one, this Romans one. I'm gonna start at uh, I'm gonna start at 21. You gonna read all the way to 32? Yeah. I've been holding that for oh, like the last 20 minutes. Come, this Romans one and 21, because that when they knew the Most High, they glorified Him not as as the Most High. Neither were thankful, but became vain in their imaginations, and their foolish heart was darkened. Professing themselves to be wise, they became fools and changed the glory of the uncorruptible God into an image made of like unto corruptible this man. This Esau pushes. This is what the other nations push. We never, not one scripture in the Bible in our culture pushed this dumbass shit. No. This is going to the heathens, like with Jeremiah 10 to learn not the way of the heathens. This is learning the way of the heathens, learning the way of the wicked. Yeah, because you know what? There were... uh. And it's funny that it was Vashti, but it, within Elam, you know, they had a couple, uh, there was a couple centuries or a couple time periods in their history where they had queens that had multiple husbands and all those empires failed. Yeah, all right. They yeah, failed. So, yeah. all right. But go ahead. And the war, the wars over who the, the, the heirs were. Mm. It was confusing. Go. But go ahead. It's Romans 1 and 23. And change the glory. Damn. Come on, Damn, son. Right over there, brother. Jesus said, no. That thing should be down. It should be up anyway. Break you, Bob. Yeah. yeah, you don't want it to like fall. It should be on the floor anyway. Break you. Go ahead. It's Romans 1 and 23. And change the glory of, of the uncorruptible God into an image made like a the corruptible man and of birds and a four footed beast. And of creep and creeping things. things. Wherefore the most high gave them up to uncleanness through the lust of their own heart, which is their mind. This is so this is completely unclean. Right. right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. To dishonor their own bodies between themselves. Yep. Who changed the truth of the most high into a lie Ooh. and worship and serve the creature more than the creator who is blessed forever. Amen. So it goes back to what Yach said his statement about the works. The works is putting itself above the the the, the craftsman, yeah. All right. and who, who formed them. Hey, uh, the brother seek understanding um, off the uh, off the comment board said also they have found out that they that the sperm travels all the way into the woman's brain. Yes, um, it's, in brain. Brain it's in the brain stem. It's in the brain stem. Right. Yeah, it's to the brain stem. Right. Yeah, it's in the brain stem. Oh, so like, I, I didn't see that. No, I'm just going. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but I just early on. Yeah, but I, I, I knew it going to the body, but to, to the brain. To the brain, no. to the brain stem. That's God how women. So why how, do you think that when right? So like when that. you get with a woman, well, I always tell you that they they eventually. I don't care how long stroke you give them, how much donkey you got, you know, <laughs> it don't matter. All right, she will eventually uh, seek another man because it's just they just gonna do it. Mm -hmm. All right. Not. All right, uh, they, and, and, yeah. and what was the Murph was made? I said that before. Murphy was, was talking about some damn some black porn star dude. How his baby mama stepped out on him. Mm, that shit you don't know? matter. So so right. So you can have the the donkey. You can hey, have the Pringles can. The it still ain't. They she still gonna you know. These bitches, these bitches be on social media. One post is they need the Pringle crank. The Pringle can. Mm -hmm. Next post is girl, you've been sleeping. They put the emoji. You've been sleeping on the shrimp emoji. 
The shirt boys, they do these bitches. They don't care. Wow. Short, tall, long, dick is dick to them. Yep. It, they don't matter. They, it's just a new. They're all, they're all on the comment board. Yeah, they don't know how. I miss that shrimp. I miss this shrimp. They be all on the comment board. These bitches wicked. They don't give a shit. God damn. Every quick. Yeah, they don't care. Everything goes. It goes back to the scripture that you mentioned earlier about a woman should come past a man. A woman now wants to be a man. They want to be in power. They want to have the power. They want to have the freedom. They want to be. They're jealous. Women are jealous <laughs> over men. They want to have what, what we have. Well, these bitches are masculine. Yeah. Right? So, so the roles, the roles where you see a woman, hey, <laughs> because what's crazy, like even in my job, you know, they know, you know, because they do different functions, and I would take either one of my women, but they say, oh, you know, your your uh, relationship is not uh, um, traditional. Uh, traditional. Yeah, they say traditional. So you, you can't have how traditional it is. You know what I'm saying? Little. This this is the traditional way. But you hear, but you hear in in every else uh, a a woman could be with a woman, a man could be with a man, but you wouldn't you would accept a man being a man, being a man being with another man, but you would tell me a man that got more than one woman that I can't bring both my women to my to y'all function, function. Right. but you can bring a man and not another man, right. no, and that's not they, because you know what it is. <laughs> they don't want to see that harmony they, that you have, and, and they, they, they and man's they husband like, see that exactly. Shit. He's <laughs> like, well, damn. You know what it does? Kind of say that in the Bible, baby. What? No, they don't want. Yeah, they don't want to they hear that. Because no, no. so, when I tell them, you know, when I tell them, you know, I, I tell, I don't hide the fact that I got two wives. I don't hide it, you know, and I don't hide the fact that I rule my house. I rule my house. I don't hide that fact. All right, so. When they see it, they look at me how the fuck I'm doing it. Nigga, you just a simp. Bitch, right? You just you just don't know how to rule and tell your bitch to stay in her place and mind your fucking business. When I go out the house, a lot of times these bitches don't even know I'm gone. They'll call me like, where you go? Bitch, mind your business. You know what I mean? Mind your business. Hey, you hey, you men, you men, men in general, to even play, I don't eat pussy because I don't trust these bitches. You won't see me putting my mouth on these hoes, all right? And that's just me. Brothers do what they do. But I don't trust these bitches for the simple fact women are on birth control. And this society is geared towards these women. And they push that. They push it. The woman told my, the woman told my, my wife when she, was, uh, when she had the baby, oh, we, we encourage a, a, a woman getting a, a, no, getting a tubes tied. They said, we love to do it. So we do it every day. We so love to do so it. So be more of a because the women, women because women get them, they get the birth control and they put them on birth control and they put they tie their tubes and now the women they they well because they can't get pregnant because their body heal itself after a while. Yep, yep. But it they can just get nutted in if for it's like eight to ten years. Right. You know they can just have a fucking freak fest. All right, they get, get get or gang bang, get gang bang, get trains, orgies, ran, on get trains ran on them, <laughs> and they big these women up as being strong and being. But the scripture is independent. independent. But a, a real strong woman is a Proverbs thirty one. A real strong woman is a feminine woman that the supports and 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 and, and is an, is a pillow and a help meet to her husband. All right, that's a strong woman. All right, fuck you bitches who feel like. God damn it, you gonna tell your hey, cause bitches like this gonna be destroyed. Right. Right? For one, that bitch ain't pretty. And the nigga who in love she with that old. bitch is the simplest of simplest. Alright? Carl. You know, Carl, you, you fucking we fucking, fucking Winslow ass. You fucking dweeb. You a fucking dweeb. You a fucking dweeb, man. Because Carl Winslow was a damn fruit. Yeah, you know, you know, it's more to this. It says, who, uh, verse 25, who changed the truth of the most high into a lie and worship and serve the creature more than the creator who is blessed forever. Amen. For this cause, the most high gave them up to their vile affection. This shit is vile, man. It says, for even their women changed the natural use that which is against nature. For one, Yes, a woman against a woman on woman is against nature. But a woman being with two men is com two men is completely against nature. Hey, to show you, a lion when a lion takes over a fucking a, a, a pride, he kills all he, the cubs. he kill a man and all the motherfucking babies 
He kill that nigga whole bloodline. He kill all the males. He kill all the males. He kill off his bloodline. All right? That's a, hey, look, that's against nature. This shit is weird. You said it's against what? Nature. Psalms 82 and 5. They know not. They Damn. Know not. Neither will they understand. See, you, see, you, nigga, you niggas so blinded, you ain't going to know, and you ain't going to get it. And the Lord, hey, like the scripture, the scripture that was read earlier, the Lord know how to reserve the, the righteous, and the Lord also know how to reserve the wicked into punishment. All this shit, you niggas ain't doing nothing but going after your lust. All right? This, this weak-ass bitch. All right? You niggas going crazy. This bitch ain't pretty. This bitch, a head full of fake hair. Well, it don't matter if she was pretty. It don't, ugly, it don't matter. Real hair. This, this, this shit, matter. This shit, right. this shit, this shit just matter, wicked. Bro. Yeah, let's get back to that. I got to see that. Like that. Uh, and Yacht was holding the same set of script. That's my... <laughs> they know not. Just neither will they... Uh, break it down, you're wrong. You're wrong. <laughs> they know not. Neither will they understand. They walk on in darkness. All the foundations... This is to the title of the lesson. All the foundations of the earth... Are out of course. Right, so this shit is out of course. Yeah. So this every, should be... And real quick, everything, how the Most High, he set up all the nucleuses. Yeah. He set up all the foundations yes. of how right. things should Wrong. be. Right. So right now, with Esau, Edom, the mm -hmm. wicked ruling, every, all those foundations are out of course. See, with the foundations of the Most High God that's ruled with the righteousness of the Most High God, you get on earth as it is in heaven. You get a paradise. On earth, if it's ran with the foundations of Yahweh yeah, Shem Yahweh Shah. But as soon as you flip yeah. that, yeah. That's the instead, instead of a paradise, right. you're going to get a living hell. That's why you got a living hell on earth today. Yeah. Because all the foundations of the earth are out of course. Yeah. This right here is out of course. Yeah, it's not supposed to happen. What does the scripture say uh, when the wicked... Uh, Get some power, transgression increasing. That's it. exactly what, what's happening. Man. Yeah. Hey, and when transgression increases, it says that evil increases. Yep. Mm -hmm. You see, wickedness increases. That's what's going on in the world. Every single uh, year, all right, it gets worse. Every single decade, man, every single hour, every single minute, every single day, you know, yep. it gets worse and worse because. Uh, I, that was another lesson I did. Uh, wickedness reaches a new height every day. Now it's reached, and now it's reached into the heavens. That's it. That's and, it. And, and you can see what's happening in the earth. The Lord is pissed off. Yep. And His wrath has come down, and it's touching you now. That's it. You yeah, can't man. touch. You know, and then and, and, and that you know, we we watched really great fights last night. Some great damn fights. Man. And, and you know, the fight starts off. You know, they don't always just take right off. Mm -hmm. But usually that first, you know, first couple minutes of the first round or the first whole round filling is a out. filling out process. Mm -hmm. All right. And until they, you know, until they find a range and figure out. And then that's when they start so landing weird. them bombs on each other. Well, the thing is that you can't hit the Lord, man. That's right. So, the Lord, the Lord is undefeated, man. It's All right, guys. Man, they're right. You're so, all too short. so every time, you, you know, every time you even think about swinging, you get that counter smack. Yep. Smack, right. smack. And so. The Lord is about to give that devastating knockout blow and knock this place off. That's it. Right. Go ahead, no, bro. man. God, man. I was out. out. And somebody just told me, man, like, you like you mad at the world. I'm like, you, you're right, because I'm tired of being around all this fucking wickedness, man. That's, That's it. it. This right. shit is weak, weak, man. It sucks, man. It's yeah. Un 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 uh -huh. un you know, it's just unending fuckery. Right. Yeah. Right. right. It's <laughs> never, it's never ending, man. <laughs> Wherever you go, it's That's like, like you, it's, it, you can't get no peace, man. You leave one group of niggas, then you hit some damn pale niggas. Yes. All right. Uh -huh. Well, you know, it's, it's like, I'm up there in, in Wicker Park, Bucktown. Every day, and, and I'm thinking I'm getting away, uh, away from niggas, and, and the damn cracker smoking that funk weed. Man, man. Now they, they they smoking the damn shit, man. Uh -huh. It's like what the fuck that smell coming from? White people smoking it. Yes. So and and, and that's as ignorant as niggas, man. There's no escaping fuckery, man. Right. And then uh, then up there too, and then up there, especially once you cross in that that uh. Uh, uh, Milwaukee, mm -hmm. you know, that all North Avenue, right, Milwaukee, right. Yep. all them gothic people, uh, dudes with titties yes. all over the damn place. Mm -hmm. Get tired of seeing that shit, man. Mm -hmm. And that's something I don't know if it's going on in other cities, yep. but in Chicago, there's a lot of white men 
They got beards and titties. It's like it's trending. Yeah, it's shit like out. it's some, you know. Oh, yeah, it's like what the hell is going? Those two things don't go together, man. <laughs> <laughs> they don't get it. They don't go together, man. Yeah, but those, these are signs of the times. Absolutely. You tired of seeing that shit, man? Yeah. These, yeah. these are signs of the times, and just like, oh, go ahead, bro. I was just gonna say these I people. Like, some of these people are school teachers. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Yeah, it's weird as fuck out here, man. Yeah. Uh, I just had a quick one. This is Proverbs 28 4. They that forsake the law praise the wicked. So whether you, you they tacitly <laughs> serve the Satan, they right. serve the Satan, they right. openly right. serve the Satan. Right. right. You know what I'm saying? It says, but such as keep the law contend with them. So so from, from what? Vashti to Jezebel to Cardi. The Lord always set up men to rebuke this shit. Right. You know? So and, and, and then when the men rebuke it, here it is, we get all the uh, you a hate group, you a cult, you the, the bad guys, yep. you know, when all we're doing is exposing wickedness that has the world like it is today. Uh -huh. See, we want the world to be where, hey, everyone rejoices. Everyone, from right. the, like I always say, from the rulers all the way down to the last being ruled over, man. And in the kingdom, after the punishment of the heathen, that's what's going to happen, man. After uh -huh. the, er the eradication of the wicked nation of people, Esau, right. Edom, you're going to get a paradise on earth and you're going to have the people that's being ruled over, the heathen nations, and they're going to be ruled over by the Israelites yeah. that's going to be ruling in righteousness. They're going to ultimately rejoice. That's right. uh, they're going to ultimately truly live. Ultimately. Right? Yeah, ultimately. But, but see, right now, like the, the, we said, the earth is given to the hand of the wicked. They cover the faith of the judges. This place is very revolted and gone. This is um, this is First Samuel, uh, no, uh, Isaiah 3 and 9, the show of their countenance does witness against them, and they declare their sin at Sodom. They hide it not. They hide it not. Woe unto their soul, for they have rewarded evil unto themselves. Hey, they yeah. used to hide. Yes. Yeah. They, they used, used to be to, in the closet. They try, bro, they used to try to keep their whatever goes on behind secret. every door secret. secret but society. now, Esau, Edom, they show it is is out. Right. They, 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 they don't hide it. They, they declare it. That it's on their they, face. They're yes. banging down the Ross. I'm coming out out of their trunk. Oh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and <laughs> and, 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 and base all the way up. Man, that's, a, that's a sign. That's a sign of the times. That's a sign of hey, the coming of our Lord and Savior is very near. Because they're not just hiding it no more. It's all open. It's being pushed. It's you you can go get it. That's it. You can wind up getting a Nobel Peace Prize for Ooh. coming out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, peace or peace. Yeah, you you you'll get rewarded. You'll get put on the the Ellen DeGeneres show. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hey, you you are so brave and yes. courageous. Yes. You came out and you did, and you were a football player. Yes, yes. yes. And you're, 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 yes. You you've been in the NFL and you're just this big yes. diesel truck. Yes. You know, and yes. but you're coming out <laughs> like you love mix. It, it gets rewarded. Yeah, uh, uh, they made a big uh, uh, right. Why can it be like? Wow, you're really in love with the woman. That's that's great. Right. No, right, but right. you but it, it, but that don't even get talked about. No. Nope. Nope. But nope. you know, you just big for nothing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Big yeah. soft ass. You got a yacht. Like right. Like you say, brother, brother, walk around four foot eleven, wishing he's six foot five, <laughs> two hundred ninety pounds. Yeah. And this nigga six foot five, two ninety, and soft yeah. as fuck. Did y'all yeah. see? Did you see the video? Yeah. Magic of, Johnson's son. Like, oh, it was, it was, it was, it was a video of uh, oh. the cheerleaders and then and doing <laughs> and this one six four six five. 200, 300 pound nigga oh, came out doing the flips and did the splits and all the bitches were cheering. He part of the, the cheerleading squad. Oh, right. I've seen that. And it was like, and then all the comments like, man, this nigga was supposed to be on the football <laughs> team and this nigga's out there sashaying and oh, whatever the fuck. Say, like, man, y'all might have won if this nigga was Exactly. Hey, y'all did. Going back to what you said, uh, you know, <laughs> you speak out against it, then people hate you because you know the scriptures say he. He, he hate him that rebuking in the gate, especially if you're a nigga uh, correcting it. Exactly. The world really hates that. Well, yeah, the Lord, the Lord yeah. said, "You you gonna be hated of all." Oh, go ahead. This is Amos five and ten. They hate him that rebuking in the gate, and they abhor him that speaketh uprightly. You speak uprightly. You speak the righteousness of God. All right, then they're gonna hate you, just like the Lord said. If you were of the world, the world would love his own. But because you are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hates you, man. Yeah. Especially if you're a Jake correcting it. That's it. The world really going to hate you. Oh, yeah. Jake, they want you to be a nigga. Right. Yeah. And it's, it's no problem. <laughs> because he said, hey, 
the Lord say, hey, <laughs> they hated me before they hated you, you know? And so we're in good company, man. We're doing we're, we're, we're doing uh, 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 the job of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, man, gave us to do. And so, of course, we understand the backlash that we're going to get. We understand the being lied on and being demonized. It says, hey, blessed are ye when men shall hate you and reproach you and cast out your name as evil for the son of man's sake. You see? And so, <laughs> right, 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 right. this is 2nd Edges chapter 4, verse 28. It says, but as concerning the things whereof thou askest me, I will tell thee. For the evil is sown, but the destruction thereof is not yet come. All right, so I always give the analogy like, hey, you sow an a, a, a apple seed, you're going to get an apple tree. You sow a, a peach seed, you're going to get a peach tree that's going to produce peaches. You, show, you sow an evil seed. You're going to get an evil tree that produces nothing but evil. And that evil is just going to heighten and heighten and get bigger and bigger until it reaches its bounds that it cannot pass. Till it reaches the height, all right, that the Lord allowed. Because it says the evil is sown, all right. Y'all watch me out shot so the evil. So he the only one that's going to come uprooted, right? So it says, verse 29, if therefore that which is sown be not turned upside down, so, and what's sown? The evil is sown. And he said, if it be not turned upside down. Well, we just read in that uh, Psalms um, 82 how the foundations of the earth are out of course, right? The foundations of the, the earth are out of course. It's upside down. So if you turn upside down, upside down, you get right side up. You see? So it says, if therefore that which is sown be not turned upside down, and if the place where the evil is sown pass not away, then cannot become that is sown with good. So our sentiment and our prayer should be that, Lord, please hasten that day to come and uproot this evil seed that you've sown so we can plant the good, which is the kingdom of heaven. You see? But if you about this one, that's why the scripture says so many times to us, the Israelite, Israelites, if be not a friend of the world. If you're a friend of the world, you're an enemy of the Most High God. Right. This is the one that was sown in evil for the Most High's purpose and for the Most High's time. And that purpose and time is almost up. And if he come find you trying to flourish and prosper and be with this world and accept you know, all the madness that's going on in it, then you part of the problem and you're going to be part of the wrath of the Lord. You see? But if you sign and crying and you have, you know, changed your mind, renewed your mind, that's why the scriptures tell us, make your body a living sacrifice and be not conformed to this world. All right? Because this is the evil. All right? It says, uh, trans be transformed by the renewing of your mind to be born again and roll with the righteousness of the Most High God. Uh, you see, I had a uh, quick one to, to back up that Psalms 32. This is uh, Isaiah 24, and I'm starting at four. The earth mourneth and fadeth away, the world languish and fadeth away. The haughty people of the uh, earth do languish. The earth is also as defiled under the inhabitants thereof, because they have transgressed the laws, mm -hmm. changed the law. ordinance. So that's taken, and this is what Esau even done. They yeah. basically went to the scriptures right. at that wisdom of Solomon, the second chapter. Um, the Bible says. Thou shalt not steal. Um, we're stealing. Thou <laughs> shalt not kill. We're killing. Thou shalt not make false idols. Build them. Thou, they went and done everything that's clean. Yep. That they said they clean. shaved their face ball. Yep. Yes. All right. They do everything opposite of what's holy, what's righteous. And we're talking about, you know, mainly Esau, Edom here. That's it. That's right? right. Because they're the other ones. The reason why this sort of witness is happening in this society is because of them. That's right. It tells you in Daniel... Uh, 4 and 17, the Lord set up over, you know, this place, the basis of men. That's right. All right. Go ahead, brother. He said, because they have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinance, broken the everlasting covenant. They broke in the covenant of Yahweh Barsham Yahweh Shai and fallen out the wickedness. And that's what they push and pursue. And that's why these two thirds out here just doing whatever, having a free fall, going after their uh, their appetites. It says the lust of their appetites. They following after them things because they, they, they got the free reign. Then it says, what, scoffers should come in the last days, walking after their own lust. Yeah, so these know. they these people walking after their own lust, their own desires of what they believe in their heart, what they say in their heart, my heart, that, that hey, they doing something right, but they're not. They're doing something wicked. That's why the Lord going to do this, verse 6. 
Therefore have the curse devoured the, the, devoured the earth, and they that dwell therein are desolate. Therefore the inhabitants of the earth are burnt, and few men left. Yeah, how about Shem is about to burn this place, about to send right, fire, right. and it's only going to be a few men left, which is the elect, right. the chosen that's going to get delivered out of here. And lucky the, the um some of the women in our nation is getting a part of that, because really, they don't deserve to get delivered, as much as us as well, but they don't deserve to get delivered because we don't need them to bring back the nation of Israel. All of this wickedness with the chick dealing with two husbands and all of that, that's out of order. And then and the people they want to accept and push this as something is uh holy to them, that's out of order, man. That ain't holy. That's the opposite of holy. Uh, holy means to separate, to separate yourself from wickedness, to get away from evil, to mm -hmm. push that far to the side and come after the ways of righteousness. Like it says in Proverbs 3 and 5, trust in the Lord with all thy heart and lean not into thy own understanding. All thy ways acknowledge him and he should direct thy path. Be not wise in thy own eyes. Fear the Lord and depart from evil. So you're supposed to be departing from it, not going after See, evil this, and establishing that as his knowledge. This is why the Lord is about to destroy two-thirds of so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans over here in Babylon the Great and the rest of, uh, abroad because they rejected the laws. They rejected the commandments. They, they which is the scriptures, they revolted and gone. They loved it. The Romans, they said they loved to have it so. Mm -hmm. um, this is Jeremiah 9 and 13. And, and the Lord saith, because thou hast forsaken my law, which I set before them, and have not obeyed my voice, neither walked therein. And remember, part of his voice is his servants, the prophets. All right? But I have, but have walked after the imaginations of their own heart, and after Balaam, which their fathers taught them. They've been taught by the, these niggas who've been taught by these niggas, been taught by Esau, been taught by these niggas. This, this, the, if the Lord has put you in that trick bag, it's because you have thoroughly given yourself over to that trick bag, and they must be destroyed. Well, you know what? What it comes down to is the wickedness of, of plantation, colonial plantation Christianity. That's mm -hmm. right. And, and especially within the, uh, the so-called black church, mm -hmm. right? Because the black Christianity, they accept all alphabet lifestyles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they accept all manner of wickedness. Come as you are, mm -hmm. right? with, without understanding. And bring your checkbook. All right, and bring your check. <laughs> you know, your that's check. what they do. All right, um, we gonna get ready to wrap it. You've been holding that for a while, whatever you got, brother. Come Somebody on. get Second Ezra uh, nine, nine through thirteen. Whatever you got, couple. This is uh, Second Thessalonians chapter two, verse uh, uh, ten. It says, "All with, and with all deceitfulness of unrighteousness and them that perish." So people that are uh, they have pleasure in this. We're gonna break it down. It says, "Uh." Uh, because they received not the love of the truth that they might be saved. And for this cause, the Most High shall send them strong delusion that they shall believe a lie. That's right. That they all might be damned who had who believed not the truth but had pleasure in unrighteousness. Yeah, because they that's a whole, uh, you know, uh, rainbow flag church. Um, uh, uh, right there on the, uh, like Halstead, right by uh, right by uh, Wrigley Field. Right. Um, thirty six hundred, because that's what. Uh, 3,500. No, that's like 3,600 where Wrigley Field is, right? Uh, Wrigley, Wrigley Field? Right. Yeah. Oh, Wrigley Field. That's 3,600 North. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, right by that police station. Yep. Yeah. All right. On a, on a, about a block north of that police station, there's a whole rainbow Christian church. Wow. Right. And they got the big flag on the front of it and, and come as you are. Well, I mean, but you go through that whole area, you have certain... Well, well, that, I mean, that, well, that, start, that starts yeah. Boys Town, right? Yeah, I was going to say, that's Boys Town. Because, you know, you, you can see that, that on the train. Gym, right. Yeah. You can see you know, that on the the, uh, the the west side of the tracks is Wrigleyville. The east side of the tracks is Boys Town. Because the Wrigleyville dudes be, you know, getting into it with the, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. with the Boys Town, you know. Yeah. Gay? If you look at a lot of them churches around there, the whole area, I don't care if it's Lutheran, Catholic, whatever the hell, they'll they'll have their normal thing and they always have a flag letting them know that you're included and you're, you're welcome. We're friendly. You're friendly, yeah. Well, well you see that flag in all the stores in that area yeah. too. You see that yeah. flag and the BLM flag. Yeah. And say, no, it's all intertwined. Yeah. And I, I, I've said it a million times. Black BLM Black Lives Matter is a white organization with a black name. All right. Once again, BLM is a white organization with the so-called black name. That's all it is. Bring out what you got, brother. Yeah. Second Peter chapter two verse seven. 
and delivered just like vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked for that righteous man dwelling among them and seeing and hearing and vexed his righteous soul from day to day with their unlawful deeds the lord knows how to deliver the godly out of temptations and to reserve the unjust until the day of judgment to be punished God. and every righteous israelite re represents righteous life and, uh, and I'm talking about the whole body, right. and we don't like it. Yeah. And it goes to the point with this LGBTQ L alphabet, whatever. There's many people of Jake and many people of the Hebrews that don't like it. This is an unclean <laughs> spirit, all right. And it vexes the right uh, the spirits that are uh, against it, because like the El uh, Yaakov said, it, it, if if everybody was homo, life would die on Earth. It's, it genders to death. Hey, it doesn't gender to life. Yeah, the guy gave a perfect example in that video that went that went viral. It was a very short clip. When he said you put a, a man with a hundred women on the on the yeah. island, yep. and a hundred years later you will find a vibrant uh, uh, civilization. All right, you put a hundred uh, uh, men on an island or a hundred women only on the island. What well, you gonna in a hundred years you're gonna find a bunch of bones. Mm -hmm. Right. So there it is, man. That's right. I was gonna say um, the scriptures also say like. Basically, this is why we met. The scriptures say uh, lewdness is the mother of family. Famine. That's why nobody uh -huh. got shit. Everything is corrupt and it's just fucked up. We want the kingdom. So, you know, man, how should I get us up out of here? This is Psalms 144. I'm going to start at 11. I'm going to make it quick. It says, Rid me and deliver me from the hand of strange children whose mouth speaketh vanity, and their right hand is a right hand of falsehood. Oh, that our sons may be as plants grown up in their youth. Wow. That our daughters may be as cornerstones polished after the similitude of a palace. Ooh. That our garners may be full according to all manner of store. That our sheep may bring forth thousands and ten thousands in our streets. That our oxen may be strong to labor. That there be no breaking in nor going out. That there be no complaining in our streets. Mm. That's what we want. Right. Heaven on earth. Now we can't have that with, with these Edomites in, power, in rulership because... With these Simple. Edomites of rulership, could you put their image back up? <laughs> you right? When you this, this right. is what you get. <laughs> Carl. All right. Jesus Juice. Carl. Carl and Tiger. Carl wins. All right. And Wiz. and Tiger, especially Tiger on that, that pitch on the left, he looks soft. As a matter of fact, both pitches Tiger looks soft. His name is Tiger. Tiger is soft. Carl All right. Tiger. But this is, uh, we're going to close with this. This is 2nd yeah. Ezra's 9th chapter, uh, verse 9. And it reads, then shall they be in pitiful case, which now have abused my ways, and they have cast them away despitefully, shall dwell in torments. Mm. For such as in their life have received benefits mm. and have not known me. And I know that all of them has come across the Hebrew videos and probably scoffed them. Yep. And, they, and they have loathed my law while they had yet liberty. And when yet a place of repentance was open unto them, Understood not, but despised it. Mm. The same must know it after death by pain. That's right. Mm. And therefore, be thou not curious. Well, it's for Esau. How the ungodly shall go, pun shall be punished. Mm -hmm. And when, but inquire how the righteous shall be saved, whose the word is, and whom the world is created. So the world was created for our sakes. The righteous is going to eventually. Be Inherited. saved up out of here by the way of the chariots, and um, time is short, man. Yep. WW3 is at hand. The the digital currency is at hand, and that comes along with the MOTB, and all those things are right around the corner. Anything can happen between today, and and those and the, and that uh, uh, you know that that uh whole voting shit. Right. And before that, before all that happens, and if it even happens. And all right. The knowledge the prophets. So with that, we got to give all praises, all honor, and glory unto Yahweh. Yahweh. Kwam Yasharala. Kwam Yasharala. Ba ba ba. Ba ba ba.